You may be a little frustrated completing this camo because you feel like you're shooting enemies who are taking cover from you and you just don't exactly know how it works. First, I'm going to give you a couple tips on how to make this process a lot more painless for you. So my first tip is to play hardcore mode. If you play hardcore mode, you don't really have to worry about getting those hit markers all the time. And as soon as you see somebody appearing on a head glitch, you should be able to get that kill rather easily. Now for the second tip that I do have to share, for it to count, you must be in a position where you can only see the enemy's upper torso. So let's say that this is the opponent right here, standing behind a head glitch, right? But no matter what kind of angle you're at, even if he is behind a head glitch, uh, it's still not going to count if you can see his leg. Now, if I were to stand right here in this direction, then this would certainly count as a kill going towards those camel challenges. And my third tip is they must be looking at you because if you try to blindside them, it's still not going to count. At least in my experience, it does not count. They need to be looking directly at you. So for example, when I was personally going for this challenge, I would pretty much just stand up here and I would kind of wait for enemies to appear right above that head glitch above that box and I would just shoot at him and it would count as a kill. So you have to keep that in mind. So you have to be aware of the angle that you're shooting your opponents at. If you can see his legs, then that means that it's not going to count as a kill. On the contrary, this could work the opposite way as well. If there's an enemy head glitching that area right there, this will also work perfectly to go towards those camel challenges as well. So you can pretty much just, you know, flip it around, you know, depending on what part of the map that you spawn in. This works exceptionally well when there's enemies head glitching that area right there. And you can definitely get those kills easier from this angle. All right. So Armada is one of my favorite maps to get mostly all of my camel challenges done. You can complete a lot of camel challenges in literally one match because the map is so long it allows for long shots you can get easy headshots and there's a lot of good power positions to be able to take out opponents who are trying to take cover from you so you want to make sure on armada that you get into the mindset of okay like look i'm gonna pay more attention to what's going on in these power positions especially where there's windows so for example right here this would also count as a kill towards that camel challenge and also be mindful of the other windows around the map. And another reason why I really like this map to get this challenge done, because you can pretty much do it from any end of the map. You can either be on the front end or the back end of the boat or in the middle, which is preferred because, you know, you have a point of view of this line of sight right here on these windows where enemies are going to be or sometimes enemies like to head glitch this area right here as well when they're trying to shoot at you. So you have to keep that in mind and then you can turn around if the spawns flip. You can go ahead and take a look at this other end. It's pretty much symmetrical in my opinion. It's the same exact thing and you can get those kills rather easily on this map and that's why I do recommend playing on either Garrison or Armada. You know, you want to make this process as easy for you as possible. Armada and Garrison, those maps are full of head glitches. So that's why you have to pay more attention and get into that mindset, like I said, to just go in there and say, hey, you know what? I'm going to focus on these areas of the maps. That is how I'm going to get my kills. So the last and final tip that I have to make this as painless as possible is to put a scope on your weapon. You know, no matter what weapon it is, if you need to get this challenge done, putting a scope on your weapon, such as I do here on my XM4, this just makes it so much easier to get kills, especially in hardcore mode. You're going to be able to beam people from cross map that probably won't even see you before you see them because you've already got them in your sights. You're zoomed in and it just makes the process a lot easier and a lot more accurate, you know, versus just using iron sights, for example, to get these camel challenges done. So be sure to put that scope attachment on your weapon to make this process so much more painless. If you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see more tips and tricks for other camel challenges, please let me know down below in the comments. Drop a like on this video if you did find it helpful. And subscribe if you are brand new around here for more Call of Duty content. Let's get it, baby.